What's going on, YouTube? This is BM Cool 247 Haven't done one of these in a minute, but here's a Guide the Furious Knight deck profile for the GOAT format. Um, this is would not be the most consistent deck in the world because uh, it's just a level 7, 2300 attack normal monster uh, in conjunction with the Curse of Dragon normal monster uh, 2000 attack. But um, I got one win off of it. Uh, of the one game I play, so I had to stop there, uh, clearly. Uh, so anyways, uh, the essential, the end goal uh, for this, as you can see here, is to get Guy the Dragon Champion out um, and do piercing damage with Spiral, spiral Spear Strike. Uh, so we run three of each of those. That could be Bricky, um, but it can, but you do want to draw into at least one of them. Uh, and then the other one can be a King of the Swamp or something like that. Um, for your polymerization plays and then a big shield gardener to do some defense and he works well with the skill drain that I have here that I'll be getting to uh, Sangen just for uh, being able to either get a king of the swamp or if you need a giant rat in that situation or an exiled force uh, you have those options there giant rat in order to get the either another giant rat or the earth or an exiled force or a big shield gardener so there's a lot of a lot of scenario plays you can get with the uh, giant rat um the earth in case you just need something to be on the field to be used for the you can actually use this second effect because uh this is not a uh, earth monster is actually a wind monster but you can still use the first effect as a substitute so that's fine um um and then three kings of the swamp because you can get a polymerization or just use them as a material um, some staple cards. Megamorph can be really good when you're trying to poke with uh, double the attack, the normal attack of him, or the original attack. So that'd be 4,600 uh, with uh, with piercing if you have Spiral, spiral Spear Strike, uh, which allows you to draw two, discard one. And this works for Gaia the Fierce Knight and Gaia the Dragon Champion. Um, three Polymerizations, um, Heavy Storm, MST, some staples here. Prima is pretty good for uh, recovering one of these beaters from the grave. Uh, after you use it for polymerization, snatch steel, uh, messenger of peace. So this is just stalling until you can get the, your combo pieces. And with 100 life points per turn, it's not that bad. Um, and then we have some another uh, recovery card because, again, pitching a Gaia or a Curse of Dragon is a pretty good beat stick to bring back. Uh, Ring of Destruction, Mirror Force. Three skill drains because it's a broken trap card. And uh, since you're running normal monsters anyways, uh, you don't really care about that. Uh, and even your effects don't care about that. So skill drain is great. Um, Exiled works under it, of course. Uh, Big shield uh, works in conjunction with skill drain as well. So that's really good. Uh, and three solemn judgments in case they're trying to get rid of your Gaia or your Gaia the whether it's the guy of the fierce knight or guy of the dragon champion you're going to need to solemn any uh any mirror forces or any ring of destruction um because you really only have like one shot at at uh going down uh beating down your opponents uh with some piercing damage so um yeah so here's a replay all right so i get a pretty good opening hand with big shield gardena um, and then uh, we don't have any of our polymerization cards <laughs> at all, so we'll see. There we go. Speak of the devil. There's one puzzle piece. Uh, we need two more to, to make that work. So we'll uh, hopefully allow Big Shield Gardener to defend for us. Uh, looks like they're going to poke us with DD Warrior and then see if they're going to banish her. They do not. I'm going to MST that Sekretsu. Um, I got a extender piece for my combo so what i'm gonna do is just go ahead and poke them with their own dd warrior lady um not probably not the best play because now they're just gonna break her back um which is not good not good at all um draw skill drain so i'm gonna go ahead and set that and then i also set a a, a bluff a mega morph they only attack me with Breaker because they think I have a Mirror Force. Um, and I don't even have any of that. So uh, go ahead and draw another Solemn. 
Um, again, with Bricker, they're playing it safe like they should. And then they set a Moth. Uh, I draw Curse of Dragon, which is complete, or which is the s s two of three to my combo here. And then they set a Metamorph, and then I get my th my third combo piece, which is just Heart of the Cards right there. Palmerize for the Dragon Champion himself. He he has uh, piercing damage, and then we got Mega Morph, so he's at fifty two with piercing um uh, i'm turning on skill drain in case it's like a not a man eater but a cyber jar or something stupid and uh 52 I'm gonna go ahead and poke them off so he's at 600 i get a draw to discard one and then i'm gonna exile force the uh dd warrior lady there and the nice thing about what i have here Two solemns is he can't do a whole lot. Well, he's gonna try. I'm gonna for solemn that one, and uh, I think that's gonna be it. Yep, because uh, I don't think he can do anything with those monsters, uh, especially with skill drain on the field.